Y'all already know now is the vibrate. Want to do a little demonstration and talk a little bit about piezoelectricity and uh, triboluminescence. Now, I just find out about the triboluminescent aspect, but piezoelectric is basically uh, crystal quartz and tourmaline is piezoelectric. And basically, what it is is from squeezing it or like tapping on it, it creates a electrical surge. Now that's piezoelectric and piezoelectric, piezoelectric and uh, tribal, tribal luminescence, all these words, and tribal luminescence is similar, but tribal luminescence is not necessarily the squeezing of quartz and creating electricity, but you take two different pieces of quartz and when you uh, clash them together, they actually uh, give off a spark of light. And it's spoken of that this is actually connected or this happens also with uh, sugar molecules. That sugar molecules are like tribal luminescent and when they kind of like uh, rupture or like bump against each other, they actually like creating little miniature lightning storms, so to speak, you know. But again, this is all just in the essence, just proving that, you know, uh, dealing with crystals is not just some like, oh, you know, love and light and I'm just blind like no there's a science behind you know uh, spiritual metaphysical science you know and not just what we could see with our own eyes or with our two eyes but also with our first eye but again uh, and I got this piece of uh, this is like a uh, crystal quartz it has some uh, I don't know, but it has what it is blue tourmaline in it and this is just a regular big piece of crystal quartz from Arkansas but I'm going to demonstrate this. I'm going to turn off the lights so you know you won't see me, but you'll be seeing the sparks whenever I do this. So, I'm about to turn off the light. And you don't even have to hit it too hard. But you'll see the light. but I want to see I want to do a side where I know I'm going to get a lot of sparks at and I want too much rupture crystal all right. and it's called cold heat uh, I mean not cold heat uh, before I even, hold on, <laughs> I got it right here, I got it. oh, cold light, because, again, as I'm doing this, as a matter of fact, and touching the crystal afterwards, you know, the, uh, basically it's not hot, so they call it cold light, because it doesn't, you know, like how you touch a regular light now, after you touch it, it's hot, or like the sunlight is hot, you know what I'm saying, it's hot light, this produces cold light, you know, so again, just, uh, 
more proof again just simple right quick you know what i'm saying i'll do another video going into it but just definitely want to just give a little example you know what i'm saying but again tribal luminescence let me spell that i gotta look at tribal t-r-i-b-o-l-u-m-i-n-e-s-c-e-n-c-e -E -E. in case you want to look it up and again like with crystal quartz it's in our technology it's in the cpu motherboards it's in watches and this one uh is new to me uh lcd lcd screens are basically stand for liquid crystal display you know somebody made a comment uh on one of the tribal luminescent videos i was watching where it was explaining it and it was like yeah you know so people who are like against crystals are scared of crystals because of their religion it's like shit if they got a phone or a computer or you know a tv you know what i'm saying any form of technology i say any but those forms of technology most mostly again anything with like a cpu motherboard or has to deal with any type of internal software you know it's, it's most likely going to have some quartz in it so again you know it's like shit if, if you're that against you know working with crystals or believing in crystals for one, your body is a walking crystal. You know, these are external helpers, but your body is a walking crystal. You got silicon dioxide. You got, uh, or should I say silica just by itself? You know, it's what a quartz made out of. You got uh, magnesium in your body. You know, uh, that's closely related to uh, peridot. You got manganese. You know, that's your rhodonites, your rhodocrosites, your rose quartz. You know what I'm saying? Like, those elements are in the crystals, you know. And those elements are also in your body first and foremost, you know what I'm saying? If you want to go back to the simplest aspects, from dust you came, from dust you shall return. But not from dust of your actual wholeness of your being, but your physical being. This little body suit comes from, you know, it's manufactured from uh, the essence of this plane of existence, you know. But again, uh, tribal luminescence is when the two quartz is rubbed together. And light is produced in piezoelectric or uh, piezoelectricity is just when the crystal quartz is squeezed or it's tapped on a little bit uh you know it causes piezoelectricity now technically you know uh while creating a tribal luminescent light you know what i'm saying or, that, or the light aspect you know there's also piezoelectricity going on as well because i'm having the whole crystal and tap it together as well which is kind of like hitting it and squeezing it so it would also produce positive electricity too and again it's about applying this to our spiritual growth you know you could be uh you know have two crystal quartz you know and and, and and making sure it's like you know two pieces that are up to the job you know what i'm saying where you do your meditation or connect and you know you feel out the energy of like these crystals don't mind being you know uh clacked together like that but, you know, you could be saying affirmations or doing visualizations while uh, tapping your quartz together, you know, to to amplify and envision that the, the tri tribal luminescent light is your solar plexus being lightened up. You know what I'm saying? Or, you know, just you, you use your imagination, you know what I'm saying? And even ampl amplify your imagination. You could spark it like, hey, this. When I uh, clack these crystal quartz together, this represents, that light represents my imagination and that inner light bulb, you know what I'm saying? The ideas and, uh, you know, uh, creating certain things, you know. But again, because at the end of the day, you know, uh, having different insight is very great. And at the same time, you know, it's like, how can we apply this? You know, how could this be a solution in my realm? You know, how can... Uh, this be actively implemented in a way that truly benefits me you know what i'm saying not just some information for me to just kind of like sit on and like and use at a party like hey did you know that quartz is tribal luminescent you know like taking it past you know just that surface level you know what i'm saying but again just want to show that and get that example i'm not gonna make this video too long now's the vibrate and matter of fact we're gonna end we're gonna do the little sparks again Let's see, no way out, but y'all know what it is. Now it's the vibrate.